Okay, so now we gotta close the valves, which you'll hand crank the engine on the, the crank bolt. So now we're getting into closed, so then you push down nice and hard to hold it. So that's no leak. Then we'll move on to the next uh, cylinder here. Okay, right, so this is the next cylinder. So again, I'll hand crank the engine from the crank. Uh, you have to have your car in neutral, or else it will try and run you over. Again, we'll keep going till we start to see the pressure go up. That means the valves have closed. I'm hoping I don't find any inconsistencies. It's just I was. Uh, Replacing my spark plugs, so I figured I would do a little uh, engine health test. Okay, so here we are. That was about as good as I could uh, hold it. So yeah, that one is satisfactory. All right, so now we're in the cylinder four. Oh, good. Okay, so they all came out pretty uniform. Um, cylinder two was a little bit lower. Probably five years ago I did a compression test and cylinder two was the lowest of the three. All the other ones were the same. Um, but yeah, I was just doing this because I was throwing new spark plugs in anyway. And uh, we'll carry on. It was maybe a 5% leak, so could be some crap in there but all the spark plugs came out looking the same so I'm not too concerned.
All right, well there's my uh, leak down test all done and my new spark plugs in. My old dudes get to go in the scrap and uh, carry on.